Ah, yeah, you calling. Here I come, baby, to save you. Oh, oh. Baby, no, my darling. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another video. So today, I'm going to be talking about Arrow Kelly. Harold Kelly has been sentenced to 30 years in prison. This happened according to the, uh, today, Wednesday, according to the U.S. Antony Office for the Eastern District of New York. Following his conviction last year on federal racket train. Racket train, uh, they are, one of the common forms of racket train is the protection of racket in which a criminal entity causes a problem and says protection against that problem. They will. Prosecutors has had asked the judge to sentence Kelly, who is 55, to more than 25 years behind bars. Why is defense Antonis asked for 10 or fewer? Same prosecutor's request was tantamount to a life sentence. Federal prosecutors recommend Arrow Kelly to be sentenced to more than 25 years in prison. Arrow Kelly Baba, see life. You see life, you see country when things they work. This how many years, you know, they do this thing. You know, they use children for sex trafficking, for sex, many things. Whether they use children, they do. You know, they do, you know, they dodge, you know, they dodge the bullets. You know, so every day, every day, now for the thief, one day, one day, the owner of the ass. That's where they be. Survivors of Kelly's abuse head hands and prayed as U.S. District Court judge and Donnelly began reading his sentence. Kelly, who wore a tan prison uniform. Ah! See, life. Now, I wrote Kelly. Now, he can't take prison uniform. So, if the Nigeria, I believe the guy will jump. If I don't want it for Apple Toramo. <laughs> not if for Apple Toram. I see big rich. You take my money. I don't sure anything for it. Nigeria. Uh -huh. Maybe we live out there, though. He wore a dark prison uniform, dark rimmed glasses and a black mask at the hearing in the federal court in Brooklyn showed no emotion. Hey, Arrow Kelly Baba, they say you don't show any emotion. You don't feel sorry. You don't show any remorse. In deciding uh, the sentence, Don, Donnie said she considered Kelly Kelly's own traumatic childhood during which his Anthony said he was repeatedly sexually abused by a family member and a landlord. So, one of the defense when they put, when the, uh, actually lawyers put forward, they say, Arrow Kelly too, don't suffer emotional ab um, sexual abuse. As a child, he was sexually abused. So, he was kind of traumatized as a child because he was abused by a family member and a landlord. It may explain at least in part which led to your behavior, the judge said. It most surely it is not an excuse. A Bible says, thou art inexcusable, oh man, no excuse. Though. Even though the fact that you were abused as a child does not mean that you, you will not become an abuser. The judge said, no, no excuse. Jovati Cunningham, a former backup singer for Kelly, praised this sentence. That means this person too, Caro Kelly too, she collects too. She collects. I started this journey 30 years ago, Cunningham, and outside the court after the hearing. There were there wasn't a day in my life up to until this moment that I actually believed that the judicial system would come true for black and, and brown girls. See, because he was just it was it assault it assault girls. You know, say this uh, Ali I went marry now. Aliyah, he married Aliyah at 15, he can't go fake birth certificates, make it come be say Aliyah, because at 15, Aliyah and a minor. So you get to fake the birth certificate, make it show say Aliyah and an adult. See, he married, can you imagine? See, he married Aliyah at 15. You see, sometimes too much of money, too much of fame, it they make people they do nonsense. He said, I stand yeah, very proud of my judicial system, very proud of my fellow survivors. And very pleased with the outcome. A jury conf convicted Kelly last September on nine counts, including one charge of racket train and eight counts of violations of the Man Act. This Man Act, what it be? It says trafficking law. Prosecutors from the Eastern District of New York accused Kelly of using his status as a celebrity and a network of people at, 
at his disposal. See this life. So people just feel say they, they they get everything like they be God, like they be God, they be God. They they, they, they command anything because they get money and they get fame. He said a network of people at his disposal. He had a network of people at his disposal to target girls, boys, and young women for his own sexual gratification. You see what he, the five-week federal trial in Brooklyn included testimony from witnesses who said they were sexually and physically abused by Kelly. If I say he own, if they do and both both to, that if they do it on both to small children, both to young children. Anyone will come away, you know, innocent. The court also heard from people involved with orchestrating the disgraced R&B singer's 1994 marriage to the late singer Aliyah. Now, this one had to talk now. Aliyah, when she was just 15, she was 15 years old and he, and he was an adult after he, after she believed she had gotten her pregnant. You can't go from... Uh, you can't go for birth certificate because the girl was 15 while Aaron Kelly was 27 then. Kelly's attorney, Jennifer Bongio, said he would not address the court, pointing to the other criminal case faced by Kelly, but said before the sentence was read that her client rejects that he is, he is this monster. Hmm. He was actually a monster. He accepted that he is a flawed individual. Bongio said, but he is not this one dimensional monster that the government has portrayed and the media has portrayed. Kelly made his only comment in response to the judge after Bonji said he won't speak. Yes, your honor, that is my wish. Bonji said she advised Kelly not to speak at the sentencing because of pending litigation against him. Now, wow, which, one, which pending litigation again? But added, he has regret. He has regret and he is sad. Nobody wants to hear what he heard today. Yeah. Pay me, Sha. Proud to sentencing, the court had heard in part statement from seven of Kelly's victims, including Jill Doe, two who testified at trial. It's been 23 years since we, we knew each other, and you have victimized a lot of guests since then, she said. Addressing Kelly, she later added, Now it is your turn to have your freedom taken from you. No one can undo the harm that you have done to these victims. Now, wow. Ha! Huh? Anthony Gloria Alfred, who represented three victims who testified, told reporters Wednesday outside court, but at least it is time for Mr. Kelly to be accountable. Defense Anthony and prosecutors argued Wednesday in court over whether Kelly even could pay a fine. The defense said he is pretty close to indigent and could not. Now, wow, that means he not get money again, no. Hey. Prosecutors disagree, saying money from the sale of some of his music rights and millions of dollars in royalties held by Sonny could cover any fine. In the nine months since his conviction, Kelly has replaced his entire legal team with Bungie and her firm. Bungie is the Anthony who helped Bill be, be Gosby. Be get his sexual assault conviction overturned and also represented Cosby in a civil case he lost this month at trial. We were prepared for it, Bonji said of the sentence outside the court. We are now prepared to fight this appeal. Okay, they still want appeal. They still want appeal. Kelly is being held at a federal detention facility in Brooklyn and is expected to be moved back to Chicago where he faces another federal trial in August on child pornography and obstruction of charges. Thank you guys. I bless it. We will stop this video. Yeah. Now wow. Hmm. This life, eh? Money and fame. People with money, people with fame, they should be careful. Because sometimes it gets into their head and they start doing just start they start misbehaving and committing crimes. Committing a lot of crimes that is just incredible at the end of the day, you know. When you have, when in a, in a country where there's structure, eh? When you're in the country where Lord Z, no matter how you hide, they will cash you one day. So guys, I'm going to stop this video. I don't want it to be so long. If you love my content, hey, please subscribe to my channel. Turn on your notification bell so that anytime I upload a video, you get notified. Till next time, guys. I love you, love you, love you. Bye.